Hi y'all, Randa here with Randa's World, and today I have a little um, Dollar Tree haul. I did find a few um, like Halloween items that was on my wish list. <laughs> of course, Molly is going to get in everything again. <laughs> and <laughs> then I found some Christmas items, and like the lady was saying at um. Dollar Tree if you don't get the Christmas stuff now you probably won't be getting it so I went ahead and got a few things Molly not my Christmas stuff oh my goodness so I got some of these these are the global brands herbal helpers detox boost and there's 20 tea bags in the box so I wanted to get one and try because I'm planning on doing a um, detox before the holiday season and then a detox afterwards. I got another one of these here. These are the charcoal bubble face mask treatments infused with collagen. I absolutely love these bubble masks. When you put them on, it actually bubbles up on your skin and like you can feel it and it feels amazing your skin gets so soft and just it, it's awesome <laughs> so I definitely wanted to get another one of those I got some of the softy um, castor oil now this is supposed to be for hair and scalp but I got this because I mixed it with um, tea tree oil Michael has a planter wart on his foot this works it really really does so you know this isn't just for your hair so I did get a bottle of it oh, I have everything all mixed up and then I saw this here it's the salon selectives frizz control it's a leave-in um, smoothing like conditioner it's a four fluid ounce bottle which I've had this um, not this one but the one in the little like tub before and it really really works and helps with like curly frizzy unruly hair so I'm gonna give that a try um, I did purchase 100 cotton balls here the assured I get all of our cotton balls our cotton swabs and um, like q-tips and stuff at the Dollar Tree for a dollar this is a good deal a very very good deal Now, I watched a lady on YouTube um, the other day, and she was talking about, like, your face and, like, other sensitive skin areas um, that, you know, regular washcloths would kind of, you know, irritate it and, you know, kind of, like, not exfoliate you, but, like, rub you raw, you know, or kind of, you know, like I said, irritate you. So she said to get some of the baby washcloths. So I got a three pack here of the Terry washcloths. <laughs> These have Elmo on them, but you know, I don't really care what they have on them. So I'm gonna try these and see how well they work. And then I found it says it holds up to two pounds, and these are kind of like you know, those command strip hooks. The removable hooks, there's a three pack of them. They had the color clear and then they had these white ones here. And I thought I would um, try the white ones. Well, let me see. I know I've got something else here. There we go. I finally found the Crafter Square Hot Melt Glue Gun finally found it and hey for a dollar this was an awesome find so I did go ahead and get one of those and that was on my wish list and then these were definitely on my wish list 
Now they had four different designs. They had one that had like a spider on it, but I didn't really care too much for it. But I did get these other ones and I'm gonna use them for my Wiccan altar, even after, you know, Halloween's over. So this one here, these are the boxes that are like books. On the side here it says curses and hexes. And then on here is the skull with roses and that. I mean, look at this. Wow. So I was so happy to find these, you know. It's getting closer to Halloween. I was like, you know, maybe I'm not going to find them. But I did, and I am so excited. So that was definitely um, wish list items. Like this one here. This says the Witch's Book of Spells. And then that's what it looks like on the, um, the spine. And of course it opens up. So I would say... I don't know. I think this next one's my favorite. Potions and poisons. <laughs> the skull. And it's another box. I was so, so excited. I was hoping I would get them, and I did before the season, you know, is over. All right, now, guys... Actually, one more Halloween item, and then it'll be the Christmas. Okay, so I picked up the three-piece decor. There are three um, witches' brooms in here, the purple ones. They had another color, too, but this one here just really stuck out to me. And I'm also going to put this on my Wiccan altar as well. Or I may make a craft with it. Not quite sure yet. Alright, so now the Christmas items. I found three wrapping papers. This one here has like Batman and Joker and all them. I got this to wrap the boys' presents with and then my nephew's um, gifts with. And then my niece loves LOL. So I found this one. And I love Hello Kitty, but I can wrap other people's uh, gifts up with it also. Look! So, so cute. It has the little houses. This one has a little um, Christmas sweater. So I got those three. Then I got some of the Crafter Square. These are poinsettias. They're six. I'm going to make a lot of DIYs with all these. And then look at the sign. I'm going to put this on a wreath. But I think I'm going to add, you know, a little bit more detail um, to the trees here. It says Merry and Bright. And this year, I know a lot of people are going with the gnomes. But I'm not too big into gnomes. So I'm going to go with the um, truck and Christmas trees this year as my theme. Last year I went with the elves. I got one of these decorative bows. Molly, no. <laughs> and I'm going to also put this on the wreath. I got the two-piece miniatures. Molly! <laughs> Cobblestone Corners Winter Village, the two trees. Um, I did see a DIY with these and with a truck. So, um, I didn't get the trucks yet, but I'm hoping to find them soon. So, that'll be for that. And then I feel these ornaments, man. Molly! I may try to do um, something a little different with them, but I'm not sure yet. So, I got these ones here. And I also got, they're sticking together the silver and gold ones and then these were also on my wish list I had saw a couple other youtubers call them 
And I think it's just the three designs. So you get four pieces or four containers. This is the star. And it has a little thing here where you can put a hook or a string through. The red bells. And the four piece Christmas trees. All right, guys, so that was my Dollar Tree haul for this time. Um, and like I said, go and get the Christmas items. If you don't go get them now, they're probably going to be gone. So please try, you know, to get there as soon as you can and go ahead and get um, the items. So I just hope you all had a beautiful, wonderful weekend and a beautiful, blessed week ahead. All right, guys, thank you so much for watching. Love y'all. Bye.